<laughs> it's okay. You can talk. Here you go. There's your coffee. I made some coffee. It's afternoon coffee. Or tea. Cocoa. Or lemonade for summer in the afternoon. Cheers. Well, I'm in San Francisco area. I'm near Berkeley, Oakland. I'm just hanging out in the shade. It did get up to about 75. It was cold, uh, especially near the uh, the Golden Gate Bridge. Oh my gosh, it was it was really cold. But it's about 70, almost 75 here today. So yeah. Um, wow. I don't exactly know what my plans are till tomorrow morning. I really don't. But I've got a lot of footage for you. I really do. And you've already seen some of it. So we'll continue on with it. Good morning. Woke up in a rest stop about 30 miles north of San Francisco. We were packed in here like sardines. A lot more homeless people in California, I'm told. Got a lot of receptacles, that's good. They're really adamant, California, about littering. There's signs everywhere, don't. Um, high fines for littering. So San Francisco's that way. It's really foggy, I can see. I don't know if you can see it, fog rolling. Look at me. And I'm cold. I'm still cold with my fleece on. My coat um, is buried. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> More receptacles. Good. But yeah, there's, um, there's a facility there. It's really dirty in there. Yeah. But look at all these cars. This is a rest stop. It will only take 30 minutes to go into San Francisco. What am I gonna do in San Francisco? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. I just wanna see the ocean. I'm gonna go north of south. I'm not gonna spend much time in San Francisco. Yeah. I'm sure there's so much to see. Oh my gosh, people are telling me, go see this, go see that. I really don't wanna stay in San Francisco too long. Because I don't want to venture too far from my van. I think that's something that we all worry about, you know. And then <laughs> I'm probably in number one area of getting theft is in San Francisco. No. Even in Reno, I didn't want to be too far from my minivan. Keep it locked up. Keep all the windows. Yeah. Mm. But it's not too. The facilities aren't that clean. Let's go see down here. I just want to show you the rest stop. It's cold. Wow, people did say you're going to get cold. I am. <laughs> I had one. I had my good green fleece blanket on last night. And I was still cold. Well, <laughs> yeah, Ooh, it's cold. <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying that now. After like a uh, hundred degree weather, it's cold. It's very, <laughs> raspberries, yeah. What's that over there?
Yeah. Where are you from? The cosmos. Where's that? Everywhere and nowhere. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes. But I incarnated in Jamaica. Okay. There you go. Yes. I came to the States when I was about 10. That's a pretty cool uh, uh, garb you have there. Very nice. Yes. And you're eating the pumpkin seeds. I got those too. Yeah. Okay. These are the dogs, the, uh, the astral yeah. and, and the etheric. Okay. The yin and the yang. Okay. And on this finger, I have a piece of terra nymphia, which is the multi dimensional earth. Uh, they call it Maldivite here. Okay. And this is Shima, the first conscious be land dwelling being. Uh, so it became a giant snake because they had no natural predators. So it just ate, consumed. At some point, it desired to fly, so it grew wings and fly. They called it a dragon. <laughs> That's interesting. Uh, here, do you care if I get up? No, my, my goodness, yes. And the feathers, where did the feathers from? Uh, different um, ocean dwelling creatures that have gifted them to the, to the sands. Okay. And I picked them up. Very good. <laughs> do you drive or walk? Um, I drive. Okay, yeah. Um, Look like you might be a walker, but wow, that's kind of like a long way. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sometimes I go for really long walks. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, for getting from city to city, I drive. I was going to walk across the Golden Gate Bridge because I need to get in my walking. I do every day, but since I've been driving, and it's really cold and windy up there. <laughs> and I turn around and I came back. Yeah. I'll have to find another place. Is there, a, is there a road that goes down to here? It looks like there might be a road. It might I be a nice road, walk. I'm not sure where, um, where it goes. Yeah. Yeah. I need to find a place to walk. I gotta get some walking in. <laughs> yeah. Want a little bit of a warmer spot. Oh well. <laughs> Hello. Sure. <laughs> or for the birds. The wind. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Oh, we're good. These are good. It was so good to meet you. Yes. Bye.
I'm out of my comfort zone. I really am. <laughs> I just am. Um, don't exactly know what I'm going to do next, where I'm going to go. I, yesterday, I wasted so much gas. I didn't know where I was going to go, and I kept going back. I kept going over the Richmond Bridge at least three or four times. I used a half a tank of gas yesterday, and at five, uh, almost $5 a gallon, it's a lot of money. It's a good $60, maybe even 70 I don't know. Yeah, I mean, at $5 a gallon. Wow. That's like going in town. That's like going... Well, I, I probably get in town, what? Maybe 14, 15, 16 miles per gallon. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to be about... I wasted about 60 bucks yesterday. So... If you want to support my travels, buy a sticker and a magnet, please. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. I do have, I'll leave the link. Um, it's, well, it's right there, minivanlee.com. Or is it on this side, minivanlee.com. The stickers and magnets. I do have two of the limited edition, one with the flag, and then me when I'm going like this, and I've got my hat on. Those are just going to be limited editions. If you want to get a dollar off on my stickers and my magnets, use the code Minivan Lee. Two words, Minivan Lee. Just put it in the code, the discount code. Get a dollar off. Yeah, go do it. It's good until the 22nd. If I get a big response, I'll, I'll extend it for you. Yeah. Well, yesterday I was, <laughs> yesterday I was near um, the bridge the bridge, Golden Gate Bridge. It's probably what? Which one's more famous, the Brooklyn Bridge or the Golden Gate Bridge? Mm. Probably a toss up. Maybe the Brooklyn Bridge might be a little bit more famous. Let me take a sip here. Well, there's a beach there. And once I'm walking away from the bridge and away from the bay, well, when you got to turn around and go back, when I went back, literally wind and sand to realize how much sand was i think i got sand blasted and i didn't have a hat on because it was later in the afternoon what a mistake because it really can damage that sand well when i got in my van last night i i went like this and there was like cake of sand my eyebrows sand <laughs> i woke and i couldn't get to a shower and i wasn't i washed up the best i could but when I woke up in the morning, I had sand on my pillowcase. <laughs> I know. I need to kind of shake everything out. I'll do it later. But I did first thing in the morning. I went to Planet Fitness and I took a shower, did my hair. Um, yeah, I really primped up. I stayed there a good hour and I just primped up. I haven't done that for a while. So, well... Um, tomorrow morning, yeah, I'm going to leave San Francisco tomorrow morning. It's just, I saw what I wanted to see. I keep telling everybody, I'm sure everybody be driving here and driving there and driving there to see. Uh, especially you, Max, you'd be doing this. You'd be going here and there and seeing everything. And um, probably Flora also, she would be doing that. I'm just not a tourist. I've got stuff to do. I was on here uh, getting my sticker orders finished up and talking to you on Facebook because a lot of you really kind of want to talk to me and ask you ask me questions so I want to answer them and um you know just getting video stuff together so that's where my joy comes in I just I found a shady spot and I'm just parked here <sighs> yeah later I'm gonna go to Planet Fitness I'm gonna do some um workout So, I'm out of my comfort zone. That's a given. I did find a park to uh, a place to park last night. It was safe. But I'm going to, my message for all of you is to make sure that periodically, you don't have to do it all the time, but periodically get out of your comfort zone and try to figure things out. It builds dendrites in your brain. Yeah, let's all become geniuses, yes. The Facebook group is doing great. You guys all you guys are all coming over. If there's more of you, come on. We're all over there. 
you have greater access to me if you want to talk to me. And you can ask me questions directly. You can message me on the Facebook Messenger. It's not like this horrible, wicked thing, you know, that Zuckerberg is going to eat you alive. No. No, it's okay. Yeah. And what else? The book. You guys are doing... Uh, yeah, you guys are um, enjoying the book. So if you haven't got the book yet, please do. Um, if you do want to support me in the gas that I'm spending, I'm probably... This, this trip here is going to cost me big time because... I'm not begging for money, um, but it is going to cost me a lot because gas is like four fifty, and it was four thirty five when I first got here. Now it's four fifty, so it's really shooting up. By the time I leave here, who knows? And it takes a it takes gas, you know, to get around. And I'm going to go on Pacific Highway. So if you want to support me, buy a book, buy a sticker, buy a magnet. Yeah, it's a good way to. Um, support if you want to you don't have to no okay you guys i love you i really do i love talking to you especially on facebook i love talking to you here yeah so get out of your comfort my message to you is um if it's time for you get out of your comfort zone do it every do it periodically do it every once in a while like i am but then I want to get into a comfort zone again, yeah. Okay. Bye. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching it all the way through.